Hey guys, Silence here. Welcome back to another Ultra Macross Gacha video. As you can see, the banner has changed to Ranka, um, and Cheryl has been kicked off the stage. <laughs> so it's time for Ranka to shine. And let's take a look at the episode plate for Ranka's um, brand new stage life, I guess. <clears throat> so, alright, from this, we can tell that Ranka's plate has a 3443 total score balancing out in all three um, factors of points yeah so the center skill for the plate is star element songs um, well we we'll gain a 25% up when it's equipped onto a unit so sadly to say this center skill is specifically just for high score purposes on yellow element songs or star element songs whichever way you want to call it by so not that fantastic in terms of center skill so don't highly recommend using it as a center plate at all the four divas equipable for this episode plate very important when it comes to planning for a high score team all right for his active skill life recovery of 30 percent that's kind of mediocre not the best recovery plate out there but you know, the main thing about this episode play, I guess, is the life skill. So at the 30 second mark, for 7 seconds, which is kind of sad, a pretty low duration period, for increase your score by 80% up. So yeah, we've definitely seen episode plates that have a longer duration period. 80% um, is pretty much on average, as we have seen. There are some, there are some episode plates out there that has 100% boost in score. Uh, but definitely not in terms of a life skill, but 80% is definitely the the norm for life skill uh, effects in terms for high score challenges. Alright, so this episode plate doesn't have any special notes attached to it. So overall, this plate is definitely looking better than Cheryl Gnome's previous episode plate um, for good job. So <laughs> if you're willing to spend the singing songs that you have stored up, I would highly recommend probably getting this one because this is definitely Ranka's best support plate in terms of score so far. Alright, let's take a look at the rest of the other plates that is included with this gacha. We have Reina's episode plate here as well, 3213. Yeah, focusing more on voice and a bit of soul. Units voice increases by 60% up. So literally this center skill overpowers Ranka's brand new episode plate straight away. Um, recovery same as Ranka's 30% and then of course at the 50 combo mark for 14 seconds see the duration is way better than Ranka's already 80% up. So this plate is definitely better than Ranka's uh, plus it also has that score note. So in the end if you're gonna pull this gacha I would say aim for Reina's rather than Ranka's. <laughs> yeah, but <coughs> if you want the costume points for Ranka's brand new costume, then I guess you probably need the new plate. But of course, it would also be good if you obtain them through the five star, um, the four star episode plates, the three star episode plates that are exclusive for this gacha right now for Ranka's costume. Um, but in terms of Useful plates. I think Reina's overpowers uh, Ranka's episode plate <laughs> totally. So <laughs> yeah. Okay, let's take a look at the other episode plates. So we have okay Sharon Gnome's plate. We don't have to go through this one because we know that this plate isn't doing so well anymore. So if you get this plate, this is kind of a bummer. So all right, the rest of the exclusive episode plates for Ranka. Yep. Uh, okay, so. Alright guys, so I've got stored up 1000 point uh, singing stones here, so I'm gonna do a 2 plate, 2 times 10 plate pool. I'm fumbling so much because I'm freaking exhausted after work and I need to sleep, seriously. I, I, I'm, la I'm lacking of sleep for the last 5 days. Oh god. Anyway guys, let's do this. Um, hopefully we do good with this run uh, Ranka's gacha. Uh, hopefully my waifu will come through because you guys know the gacha pools I've been doing have been terrible recently so yeah okay um, I do want Reina's plate more than Ranka's though in terms of play but I do want Ranka's brand new plate because of the image <laughs> and of course the costume point 
All right, here we go. One plane. So same bad luck streak going on. Hopefully with the second pool we do better. Wow. Okay, so I'm definitely hoping for a red box to evolve. Uh, Makina doesn't look happy. No evolution. Okay, lots of Makina at the beginning. Here we go. Keep going. We do get a Ranka. Any evolution? No evolution. Oh, lots of Makina. What is going on? Even the last gacha video, a lot of Makina popped up. Okay, we got Elto. Cheryl. Evolution, please. No, lots of Makina. Oh my goodness. Oh, this is not a Ranka gacha. Oh, this is a Makina gacha. No, Ranka, do not tell me. Do not give me the two thumbs up. This is terrible. Oh. Okay, we do get one of the exclusive plates, so I'm not too depressed about it. Here we go. Pop. There we go. Ranka's brand new costume unlockable via episode uh, episode off. Oh my goodness, look at all that repeats. <laughs> Especially for Makina, oh my goodness. Alright, so we didn't do too well. Let's exit out the screen. We're gonna re-enter the gacha once again. Alright, let's go. The last chance. So, yeah. We did get one episode play. Definitely not enough points to unlock the costume. We might have to sacrifice a bunch of episode orbs just to get the costume out. One, two, three, four, five. Very nice. So we do have a chance of a five star plate. No red boxes at the beginning. There we go. A five star plate. No evolution. Okay. Ooh. Ooh. I didn't expect a window here to come out. Uh, okay, that was a bit um, surprising. Lots of Makina love again. Yeah, gori gori. Ah, yeah, Mirage. Ooh. <laughs> okay, we're getting lots of random ones right now for this second pool. <laughs> it's like all the side characters are like popping up. Uh, well, we do have a few main though. Okay, here we go, the 5 star plate. Ah, hey, wait, I got it! I got the plate! <laughs> what problem is, it is only a 5 star, it's not a 6 star. Okay, so we do get, I think, decent amount of points for the costume. Oh, I'm able to unlock Rina's costume. Okay, okay, let's, we are, we're gonna go to the um, costume page. Um, we're definitely gonna try and get Ranka's costume out along with Rina's. So let's do this. Um, so yeah, we, at the same time, we can actually um, take a look at the costumes itself to see whether they're actually worthwhile. Wow! So yeah, look at the points. I, I'm definitely a few points away from um, unlocking Ranka's costume. So hopefully I have enough episode orbs stored away just for scenarios just like this. Um, okay, here we go. We got Reyna's one. Let's do Reyna's plate first. Oh! Okay, so you belong to Ray Ray. Hmm. Alright, here we go. Is that enough? Nope, not enough. Okay, 60 points away, so I guess, yeah. Let's do this. There you guys go. The bonus animation of Reyna's costume being unlocked. Fantastic! Loving this costume! Alright, so... Okay, I'm not gonna power up this plate yet. Let's see, are there any other bonus points from here? No, okay. So let's go do Ranka's right now. You guys can have a look at Ranka's brand new costume. Uh, sadly to say, I don't have a lot for Cheryl's. Yeah, that's kind of disappointing. Um, in fact, I don't think I have anything on this shadow here. Because I did do the gacha pool on the new account, so I don't have the plates for Cheryl's 
good job costume here. So yeah, and you probably have to get it through the free gacha pools in the future. Alright, so we do have three episode plates. Oh, the thumbs up belongs to a new costume. Oh dear lord. <laughs> Such an ironic image, you know. Okay, so we didn't get much points from that plate. Uh, we'll definitely get it, get more from the main episode plate itself. Overall, I think the luck for this video is pretty decent. It's not like it's a fantastic pool. We did get the main plate out though, but the thing is, the way it came out, it wasn't exactly fantastic. So it's kind of like a I would say, um, what do you call it? Um, mercy pool. No way, mate. Because of the terrible streak of bad luck, they just decided to give me one good pool. Um, yeah, mercifully. So, <laughs> yeah, that, that's how this gacha felt like it went uh, in that direction of a mercy pool. Okay, so let's see. We do get tons of points from the main play itself. Hopefully, I'll be able to um, evolve it some way or other. I'm just gonna save up the 200 stones for the remaining um, points for the event on the last three days that's currently going on. So, okay, we've taken up all the points from the episode plates itself. Uh, I'm gonna use the art orbs right away. I do have five large ones, so I don't think I'll need all of them. Uh, yeah, I probably have to use two of them. Oof. Okay, guys, so this is unlocking Ranka's costume. Just adorable. You know, I kind of. Let's take a look at the costume for a moment because I, ki I kind of like the details for this costume because it reminded me of like uh, some Neptune girl, you know, like the, the video game console um, humanoid versions, the Neptune series. So yeah, I've, I've got all of Ranka's costume that is available except the one that's evolved from Kawawa rank though. So okay, let's take a look at Ranka's costume. Um, so you see like the the ribbons on the hair, they kind of look like control analog joysticks. Or rather analog buttons. Yeah. So I don't know what is going on with that headpiece though. It's it's like a sticking out piece of like some kind of satellite hardware. <laughs> I, I love the the um, goggles, <clears throat> that <clears throat> protective gear, protective eyewear, very cool. Red and green goes well together, I guess. And of course, she's wearing the construction bikini that we are so used to seeing in um, Sayonara no Tsubasa, um, Macross Frontier's second movie. Um, the gloves, though, kind of look like a carrot design, um, just that with black cloth you know for the fingers and the back portion of the glove i love the fact that there's a safety helmet on her bracelet that is just freaking adorable yeah so yeah for cosplayers who want to do this costume take note of the um small details we don't have the gigantic wrench from the um tokyo sky tree blue moon showcase version though so we do have a few wrenches here a lot of um, what do you call this rings? I know harness rings, I guess. Yeah. So I'm loving the straps, the belt buckles, and the shoes. Got like gigantic bolts of screws in them. Yeah. So if you kind of like have a pair of jeans that you don't like, you can probably cut them up and become this kind of pair of shoes. <laughs> That's what it looks like. It looks like a um, a pair of jeans that just got cut up <laughs> and made into a skirt. <laughs> kind of like a skirt. Uh, yeah, so that's pretty much what I think of Ranka's good job costume. Uh, the design is pretty uh, intriguing. Um, 
Yeah, so it's like a bikini plus a skirt. And yeah. Very cool design though. Alright guys, so that's pretty much it for this gacha video. Uh, once again, thank you guys so much for watching. If you like what you see in here, do hit the like button and share the video to all your friends. And I'll see you guys in the next Utame Cross video. Until then, bye!